If your PC is running low on space, uh, you can control storage by uh, going over here into System and Storage. And there's uh, things you can do down here. It shows you where everything's being stored at. Uh, you can turn on Storage Sense to free up some space. And then if you click down here to change how, there's a few features here. Well, in the new Fall 2017 uh, edition of Windows, we have a few more uh, options available to us. So if we go to the same screen, you'll see down here when we click on Change How, we have a few extra uh, things here. We can still delete the files, and we can all delete the other ones in the recycle bin, but now we can actually target the ones in the download directory. Now, I keep all my downloads, so I'm not going to use that one there. Uh, what we're going to focus on today is this previous versions of Windows where you can actually uh, delete uh, previous versions of Windows that are using up space and uh, ones that you don't need. They're going to do it after 10 days anyways, but we're going to go ahead and do it now. So here we're going to look at my uh, test system where I test new versions of Windows. And you notice I have a couple uh, new uh, folders here. Besides the current Windows, I have Windows Old. And I even have Windows Old 000. And it depends upon how long uh, ago... Uh, they were in existence and whether or not they're kept. So if I want to go here and right click on this and I go look at the 00 old, you can see it's only 97 meg. It's an old installation where most of the files have already been uh, gotten rid of by the system. Now if we go back uh, to my listing of versions, you'll see that besides my Windows, I have that Windows old, which is the last one, which because it's less than 10 days, it still has a considerable amount of files in it. You see all the files that are listed here. So that's got quite a bit of uh, stuff I could free up if I don't care about it anymore. So uh, I could try and delete it right here, okay? Because it's got uh, uh, 23 gig available. So on a small SSD drive, that's a significant amount of space. As a matter of fact, if we go over here to uh, this PC over here and uh, open up a new window, Take a look at it, you'll see that this is an older system, so it's only got a 120 gigabyte drive, and I've got only 34 gig left. So I could I could use some extra space. So let's go back to the uh, screen here, and we're going to go ahead and try to delete previous versions of Windows. Now you notice it doesn't say last previous or one previous, it's all previous versions of Windows. And uh, again, I have uh, two extras here. I have Windows, Windows Old, Windows Old 001. So if I click on Clean Now, uh, I'm not going to do the downloads because I like keeping my downloads. Uh, it says clean up files. It may take a few minutes. Now, the truth of the matter is this took about three to four minutes, but we're going to skip to the end here. So here we are. Uh, it took actually more than like five minutes. So if you look at the lower right-hand corner uh, now, uh, it, it goes ahead and finishes at uh, 8.46, uh, right about now. And there we go. And it says here that we were able to clean up 8.8 .8 gigabytes of space, uh, which is again significant on a small disk drive. So let's go take a look at our system now. So if we go back to the uh, Explorer, File Explorer, and we want to check this 8.8 .8 gig, and we click over here in the window I had open, and you'll see that there's no more out of the other two windows, uh, Windows.000, Windows.old, I mean. So let's go check over this space. Now this doesn't show it yet because I'm going to click over here and go refresh. 34 gig and it's now 53 point something. We, uh, that's how we cleaned up the uh, disk space by deleting the old version of Windows. So there you have it. Even more features uh, to help you clean up your storage space in Windows uh, 10 Fall 2017 Creators Update.